Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, fellow YouTubers and subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe, thumbs up if you like the video. This is my latest and greatest creation, yet another Nintendo 64 portable. And I'll give you the basics and a rundown real quick here. It is a custom 3D, print, 3D printed design that I built. And <clears throat> it has uh, built-in batteries that'll give you about two and a half to three hours of gameplay, depending if you use a regular game or an expansion pack game. It has a built-in expansion pack, and um, it has got a built-in fan, your memory card slot, jumper pack slot. There you go. You do not want to be charging and playing at the same time. That just won't work. I'll tell you that right now. Because what happens is when you do plug it in, the system wants to use the the power from the cable and there's actually more amps in the batteries when they're fully charged than there is in the charging amps that are coming through your cable so maybe with a higher charging amp cable you could charge and play but right now it's just going to give you that so you can't charge and play with uh, a cable that's just not going to have enough amps in it. That's what I, I'm thinking. I don't have a cable or a charger that has more amps in it, but just letting you know, you fully charge it, and you get about two and a half, three hours of gameplay out of it. 007. Goldeneye. All right, guys, that's pretty cool. So we know that works. Here's an expansion game. I'll put that in there too, so you guys can see it working. Don't really want to waste too much of you guys' time, so you got your D-pad, your micro joystick, your translucent. Uh, I casted these buttons myself. Everything is handmade. You got your uh, dual Z buttons, and you have your L and R button as well. Here's your dual Z buttons right there, and your L and R button as well. Alright, there you have it. Zelda, Mayor's Mask. You guys are probably itching for some gameplay. So we'll put in the EverDrive 64 and I'll just show you guys some games. So you guys know that it does work off of the EverDrive 64. Originally I wanted to put the LED right here. But since you're playing, you can't really see it. So I put it up here instead. Alright. You guys are probably really itching for some gameplay. Here's the menu screen, so you got your brightness, your contrast, your color, your uh, 16 by 9. Some people might, you know, want to change it. I think it's more practical to put a 16 by 9 screen in because there's games that do support it. And if you don't like the 16 by 9, you simply just change it. Unless you would have a uh, smaller screen, but I think it's nice to have a bigger screen. So that's a 4 by 3 inch LCD. Don't worry, when you're looking at it, it doesn't do that. It's just my camera. It doesn't seem to want to focus properly. There we go. What fun! Oh, hello! Goodbye. Well, I didn't think I could actually make this video in under five minutes. I don't want to waste too much of you guys' time because I know you guys do have stuff to do. But I'll be making more of these. And, um, yeah, definitely. Who's in the world? How about that, guys? Does that sound good? So, yeah, thumbs up, subscribe. And I'll be coming out with more portables. Probably the same design. Maybe I'll tweak it up a bit. Maybe the cartridge will hang out the back like everybody else's, just sticking out the back. But I think it's nicer to have it in here since, you know, I'm, I have batteries on both sides anyway. So it just, it makes it really good.
Don't want to have it too loud, though. Alright. Let's cruise the world. I just picked one. Can I go back? I can go back. Hey, that one looks... Oh, the black one. Ooh. Look at all these cars. Okay, I'm gonna pick the red one. No, the black one. Man, I can't decide, guys. We'll go with that. That sounds good to me. No, no, no. Oh, man. I was going to choose a different stage. But that works, guys. That works. Oh, look at that power on that car. Woohoo! Yeah, this is an arcade classic. These cruising games. Yeah. Interesting how they um they did a James Bond kind of music. And uh they kind of did some animal voice remixes. Whoa, that was awesome. Look at that, first place. Oh my goodness. That guy was flying. But hey, you know, I appreciate you guys subscribing and watching my videos. If you could, thumbs up. And uh, subscribe, I'll have more videos out for you guys. I'm glad you guys enjoyed it. Thanks again. You guys have a good one. I'll probably have this up on, uh, yeah, I wanted to say, I'll probably have this up on Etsy.com or eBay. Um, I might just get rid of it through PayPal because I will be making more. Mm. So, yeah, just uh, shoot me a message. All right, take care, guys. Thanks again.